I bought a $300 Pokemon card collection from my YouTube editor. So today, for the first time ever, Breaking Family, you will get to meet my YouTube editor. Hey. Hey. I got something to show you. What? Right over here, I got a package. A package? Yeah. Yeah, right over here. Not that one. <laughs> Don't spoil what I'm about to say. <laughs> no, you're gonna spoil it. Don't spoil it. This package right here. Okay. Do you know what it is? No. It's bulk. Bulk. It's a box full of bulk. What bulk? Bulk Pokemon cards. <laughs> so right here is currently some of our bulk Pokemon cards that we have sorted out right now. So you can see why Marie is not the happiest. So my editor and I decided to make today's video a little bit of a challenge. Get him the cards that he needs off his list, or I end up paying him $300. Now here is the thing. I have no idea what's inside of here. Marie, mm -hmm. he said, do you want bulk? And I said, yeah. Just what we needed. Of course we needed. <laughs> <laughs> no, he knew that a bunch of this was gonna help out with our Pokemon card library. He knew that we needed a lot of like the commons, uncommons, and rare stuff from a lot of the past sets. So mm -hmm. inside of this box is gonna be a lot of that. So let's go ahead and open this up now. We haven't officially done the trade yet. What do you mean officially done the trade yet? Well, I, he sent the bulk and he sent me a list of cards that he needs. Uh-huh. We gotta find those cards. Oh boy. But we might find some of the cards would then take away a little bit from the 300. All right, I gotta be very careful because I have no idea how this is packaged. John, you did one, one good job on this. So much tape. John says he's gonna tape a box. He means he's gonna tape a box. Yep. And oh, look at that. We got another storage container too, which I didn't know was part of the deal. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh oh. Ooh. Look what we got here. We got a Psyduck, a little Psyduck plushie. Giving Psyduck a brand new home. He said he did include some extra goodies, which, since John is editing this video, mm -hmm. he doesn't know that I'm. Uh, well, now he knows he's, he's editing it, but he doesn't know. He's, he's finding out for the first time. You see what I mean here? Like, he's yeah, finding yeah. out for the first time, but he's editing the video. Right. So, like, right now, in this very moment of us recording, he has no idea, but as he's editing it, he knows. Does that make sense? Wow, my head is spinning. Anyways, I'm including some extra goodies in his package as well. <laughs> okay, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, this is nice. I can see those. This, no, no, you can't. There were evolutions. Oh, uh, what makes you say that? Oh. <laughs> 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 I thought there was some on the back. <laughs> okay, okay, yeah, look at this. Look, we got evolutions right here. Is there glare? Oh, cute, no. Okay. Glaceon, Vaporeon, Weavile, everybody's favorite evolution, Weavile. Uh, ditto. Look at those. Oh my god. Now, goodness. this is done by your favorite artist right here, Yukimori, yes. right? Oh my goodness. <gasps> Arcanine. Look at, Look at that Arcanine. Arcanine. That is beautiful. Heart gold, soul silver right there. And we have a suspicious <laughs> food tin as well. Very suspicious. Look at this other side right here. This is the side that I could see. It's Noctowl, Slacking, Dialga. Nice Pokeball play logo in the back. Look at the flaring. Oh, wow. Aww. Those are beautiful. And that Snorlax? Oh, which is perfect timing because Pokemon Sleep is out right yes. now. Yes. If anybody needs some Pokemon Sleep, friends, make sure you leave your code down in the comments. And then all you can go down there, Breaking Family, and become friends with other Breaking Family members on Pokemon Sleep. I don't know if I should reveal in the video what I'm, what extra I'm including. I wouldn't. Yeah, yeah, because you're gonna see this, John, so. I'll see it. Just a little nice extra surprise. Ooh, this says, look at this, this says open last. Well, I'm, I'm gonna see what it is and then we'll open it last. Ooh, okay, okay, look at this. Unbroken Bonds. Ooh. Three of the cards that he needs is Sylveon Gardevoir, Full Art, Rainbow, and Alternate Art. So if I pull one out of here, I can send it back to him. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have the bulk. Oh, okay, wait a minute. What we got here? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Look at this. Oh, the Psyduck right there. The Flareon. Flareon, Meowth, Raichu. That's cute. We see the Hasbro logo on the back. These were in the uh, the Toy Wishes magazine in the late 90s. Got our favorite Pokemon right beside each other. Yeah. My favorite Psyduck, your favorite Flareon. Yeah. It's amazing. Love it. it. Says, hey, Nate, Marie, and Evie, we hope this vintage bulk helps you out with the Pokemon card library. And there's also a few extra small bonuses inside. Enjoy. Hope you both are having a wonderful day. Thanks for being great friends, John and Kate and Scrabble. The best evolution and Pokemon. Well, I disagree. Yes. I'm nope. now sending it all back. No. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Now we're gonna go through a lot of this bulk 
back in the studio. However, you might be wondering what this is. What is up, my breaking family? Send in some positive vibes in your direction. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I, I just forgot. I never formally introduced you all to my YouTube editor. I gotta say, he is absolutely amazing. I love him, and to me, in my heart, he is a friend first, and then he's my YouTube editor. We have really uh, bonded over the past few years, and uh, I just love him to pieces. One of the neat things is, is that he has actually been a Breaking Family member years prior to e us even talking. So he's been a fan of the channel for a long time. He's been over to my house. He is the person that makes the magic happen right here on this channel. When my head turns into a Psyduck, that's him. The Machamp-like strength, that's him. Kimbo! That's him. I honestly couldn't make a lot of the really cool stuff come to life here on this channel if it wasn't for him. So everybody, please give a warm welcome to my friend, John. Hey everyone, my name is John, and I've been a huge Pokemon fan and collector pretty much my entire life. I even used to play competitively and host a Pokemon League back during Generation 4 of the TCG. Something you may not know about me is that I've been Nate's video editor here on the channel for the past few years. I've literally edited hundreds and hundreds of videos for the channel. Recently, my wife Kate and I organized all of our vintage Pokemon card bulk, ranging from base set all the way to the Heart Cold and Soul Silver era. While organizing the vintage bulk, we decided to keep at least one play set of every unique Pokemon card, meaning we kept at least four cards. However, all the extra cards beyond a play set we decided to put aside to eventually trade. Most of you probably already know this, but Nate has been working on collecting at least one variant of every English Pokemon card for the Pokemon card library. And I wanted to help Nate out with the library, so Nate, I hope this bulk helps you out. One last thing, just like Marie, Flareon is also my favorite Pokemon. But you know what? Psyduck's cool too. Here it is, $300 worth of a Pokemon card collection. It is bulk, and a lot of this is gonna go into the Pokemon card library, but we are gonna go through this, not go through all of it, but we are going to go through this, and uh, then I'm gonna show you what I found that John needs for his collection, but will it equal $300? Well, I don't wanna spoil anything, but there will be a Pokemon card opening at the very end that will include Tag Team Pokemon card sets, because we are trying to pull $300 worth of cards that John needs for his collection. But first, let's go ahead and take a look at this bulk right here. You can see that there is multiple copies right here of a lot of these cards, but that's perfectly fine because I know other people that might need some of this, but we need to fill out the library. Filling in a lot of those empty spots is, uh, is a task. A lot of commons, uncommons, and just rares, and he has organized this in a uh, this, oh, look at this Meowth right here. I absolutely love this Meowth. A lot of Heart Gold, Soul Silver era stuff, which honestly is one of the eras that I am missing a good amount from is the Heart Gold, Soul, Sil Soul Silver era Lickitung right there. Love that Lickitung. Beautiful. Done by Yukimori, which there is multiple copies, so that can go into Marie's Yukimori binder. We got some Bagons right here. Breaking Family. Lots of bag-ons. Like I said, we are going to see a lot of commons, uncommons. We got Tomokazu Kamiya artwork right there. You can see my favorite artist, Tomokazu Kamiya. But we need a lot of these, and uh, John is definitely helping us out. John approached me with this, uh, basically saying like, Hey, I, I got a bunch of bulk. I know it can help you with the library. And so, um, so that's kind of where we're at right now. We even got trainers in here as well, which... I always love seeing some of the older trainers, like some of these you can still use in standard format. They're just old copies of it. I mean, look at this, Defender Switch. You can still use Switch uh, in, the, in the current format right now, standard format. So it's really neat to see some of these older artworks. Legend Box right here. We got Junk Arm going into Dual Ball. Also going into a Night Teleporter, Pokédex. As I had mentioned, he has sorted a lot of these out. Drowsy in here from Heart Gold Soul, Soul Silver Era. I have a hard time saying that one. Heart Gold Soul Silver Era. We got Rosalia and Skorupai for some artwork in here as well. More Skorupai. Oh, look at that Jinx. Oh, I love that Jinx. Are you kidding me right now? Love that Jinx. Okay, I know, I'm seeing a lot of these, and I'm like, I definitely need this for the binder. Mine Junior, I mean, when's the last time they printed a Mine Junior card? 
for all the Ralts fans out there. We got Booger Squad with the Grimer. We got Unknown. Oh, I love that one. We got more unknowns right here. Just lots of unknowns. We hit the unknown jackpot. Well, I, I know what it is. It's just, it's unknown. But it, I, it, it's, it's an unknown jackpot, but I know what it is. You, I mean, you know what I'm saying. Where is that Fampy squad at? Because there is a family of Fampies right here. We got Aerodactyl. Look at that. Whew. It, oh, it's always weird to see Aerodactyl as an uncommon. Wait, is that uncommon or common? That's common. My eyes are playing tricks on me. Krogunk, Tomokazu Kamiya artwork right there. Love Tomokazu Kamiya artwork. We got Baltoy, Anarith, Sudowoodo. Starting off with Tomokazu Kamiya artwork once again with that Poochiena. Oh, look at that. That Poochiena needs some belly scratchies. Belly scratchies for Poochiena. There you go, belly scratchies. We got more Poochiena. Going into Mighty Anna. I guess that only makes sense to go into a Mighty Anna. Carvana. Ooh, nah, nah. Like I said, we're not going to go through all of these. I'm actually skipping um, a lot of, of these cards because uh, <laughs> we would be here forever if we went through, like, every single one of them. Matang. Going into uh, more artworks of Matang. Aeron. And... Oh, wait. Is this all Aerons? Look at this. All Aerons. Is this entire stack going to be Aerons? Wait a minute. Okay, okay, layer on, there we go. And we got shield on. Oh, check this out. War Turtle and more War Turtle goodness. Oh, Squirtle Squad, there we go. Hang on, how big of a Squirtle Squad do we have? Oh, oh, wait a minute. We have a huge, huge Squirtle Squad breaking family. Totodile, some starter love right there. Marsh Stomp, going into the Primplup. Wow, this is this is absolutely amazing. Piplup, I am just loving seeing all these old cards. Oh, this is so awesome! Quagsire right there. If you look at it really quick, kind of looks like a like a ditto. Going into a Whooper, not like not like the candy. That's that's Whopper, right? That's Whopper, not Whooper. Is there Psydux in here? Where's the Psydux? Psydux. Psyducks were in the water. Psyduck, 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 Psyduck. Uh, I say tentacool. That's cool. That's not Psyduck, though. Let's see those Psyducks. Come on. Come on. Now, now John knows my favorite Pokemon, Psyduck. There's no way that he's not going to include a Psyduck in here, knowing that my favorite Pokemon of all time is Psyduck. Always has been, always will be. John, I'm getting a little worried here. Breaking family, I'm getting worried. We're actually going through the entire water stack because... I gotta see if there's Psyduck in here. We got Buizel, Psyduck Lapras. Oh, look at that Lapras artwork with the sun setting. Are you kidding me right now? This is the last stack of water. Will there be a Psyduck in here? I might have missed it somewhere else, and then I'm gonna get a text from him when he's editing this video, being like, hey, the Psyducks were in this spot in the box. Wait, no Psyducks? Not a single Psyduck? My heart, <laughs> it hurt. I actually did include Psyduck cards and I did not forget them, but unfortunately Nate didn't find them until the day after he recorded this. Sorry about that, Nate, but I'm glad you found them. <laughs> All right, we're going into the electric Pokemon, even though there's no Psyduck. It's all right, it's all right, it's fine. I'm not upset at all. I'm not upset at all. Oh, I love this Pikachu. Oh, that's so good. It's got Pika Punch as the move on there. Oh my goodness, so many Pikachus right here. Electabuzz. Man, a heart gold soul silver was uh, electrifying. You see what I did there? Just because it's on lightning. No, no. Grass Pokemon are up next with the Turtwigs. More starter goodness. We got Shuckle Squad right there. Carnivine. What else do we got? Oh, we got more Carnivines right there. Tropius as well. Heracross. Look at that Heracross. Beautiful. Is that Yukimori as well? No, that's not Yukimori. That is not Yukimori artwork. We got Shroomish Beedrill. Oh, one of my favorite Beedrill artworks right there. So good. I mean, if you saw that in the middle of the night, you would run screaming. I know I would. Kakuna Matata going into more Kakuna goodness right there. We got Weedle. What I really love about this bulk is that it's really kind of like in the middle of the Pokemon TCG. Here, look at some of the fire Pokemon. We got Cyndaquil. Oh my goodness. Combuskin. We got Torchic as well. Monferno. Lots of Monferno. Okay, Chimchar. We got Magmar going into more Magmar. I really like this Magmar. 
Uh, what else do we got? Magby. Baby Pokemon do not get a lot of cards printed, I feel like. Houndoom. Houndour. Slugma. But Breaking Family, there is a lot more in this box. I mean, I got a stack sitting right here. You can see how big this box is. I don't even know what the count is, but we have to figure out because I haven't traded John yet. I gotta show you what we found. My editor has created a list of Pokemon cards that he needs for his collection. I gotta go through some of my extra stuff and see if I can help him out with completing his collection. Now we have agreed that it's about $300 worth of bulk. And there's definitely gonna be a lot to help out the Pokemon card library. I wanna be able to help him out, so I gotta try to find some stuff. And if, if I don't find $300 worth of cards that he needs, I'm gonna open up some booster packs and see if I can pull one of them to add to it. And then whatever we don't find, we're gonna have to end up paying the difference on it. Now he said he would rather have the cards for his collection, but he wanted to be able to help out the Pokemon card library. So if we don't find any cards or we don't find a bunch, he doesn't mind me paying him the difference. A lot of evolution stuff that he needs. Marie, he loves Flareon as well. I know. That's why with friends. Ooh, look at this. I mean, uh, GX era. I know he needs some of the GX era stuff. Uh, Sylveon, Gardevoir. He needs, but he needs full art, alternate art, rainbow of that one. Okay, so I think we have a stack just like full of, yes, full of ultra rares. Uh, I think there might be some rainbow rare Pokemon cards inside of here as well. I'm not sure if there's alternate arts, but uh, oh, look at this. Machamp GX, Marshadow GX, both of those from Burning Shadows. Tyranitar, Decidueye. Now I know that he needs a Leafeon GX. Oh, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Ho-Oh GX is one that he needs. So we found a card right here, Ho-Oh GX. We will set this one to the side and see if we can find that Leafeon GX from Hidden Fates. We got more shinies right here. Leafeon, do we have a Leafeon? No, no Leafeon at all. We got the legendary birds, more full art trainers, Blastoise Piplup, alternate art tag team. Breaking family, give me just a few moments as we go through everything. family we have the results ho-oh gx from hidden fates we got full art dialga gx from ultra prism and we have sylveon gx from guardians rising now, as you may know that list is a lot longer than three cards i was almost positive i had more of those cards breaking family this is about 36 dollars worth of cards <laughs> marie i think we're a little off <laughs> 336 yeah, yeah you might uh might want to start pulling some more cards to the studio. Now, Breaking Family, I did make a little bit of an error. He actually does not need Sylveon GX. When I was looking at the list, it was kind of separated. It's Sylveon GX and Gardevoir, or Sylveon and Gardevoir GX that he actually needs, just a regular version. And I have one right here in my binder. So boom, John, that's going to you. We have about $45 worth of cards here. So if my math serves me correctly, that's about $235. Boom, right there. See, John did that. If it wasn't for him, that number wouldn't pop up. Now I know he needs the Glaceon V and VMAX, both alternate art, and the Leafeon VMAX alternate art. And I have a bunch of evolving skies right here. We're gonna try to open this up and try our best to pull it. But he also needs all of these from Team Up and John Breaking Family. I'm pulling out a Team Up three pack. We're gonna try to pull it. And he still needs the other Sylveon and Gardevoir GXs. And this is the pack that he sent. It's from the Unbroken Bond set. We're gonna open up this very, very last to see if he actually sent me a pack with one of the cards that he needs in it. Now, a little bit earlier, you saw the trade slip. This is something brand new that I'm doing for the Pokemon card library. As you all know, I'm trying to collect every Pokemon card from every English Pokemon card set. But the thing is, is that I'm trying to document the entire process. So anytime I trade with somebody, buy a collection, find something at a garage sale, pull it in a booster pack, whatever it may be, I'm trying to document getting almost every single card. Because I love documenting things these trade slips have been created. So basically when I trade with somebody, I'm gonna fill out the slip with their username, what I traded them, what I got for my collection, the date and the location. And then I wanna take a picture with them with the cards that I got. I'm gonna print it out. And then I'm gonna take the picture in the trade slip and put it with the card that I just traded for 
into the Pokemon card library. So right behind that card is gonna be the trade slip and the picture. And that right there will further the documentation process. Now here's the thing, unfortunately I won't be able to do the trade slip in the picture with literally every single card that I trade for. So as of right now, it's just gonna be for like kind of some of the bigger cards that I, I'm doing and not just like random rares or commons and uncommons. However, uh, John did fill out one right here for all the bulk <laughs> that I just got. So uh, John will be in the Pokemon card library. So if we end up trading, you know, depending on where it's at and everything, and if I have the slips with me, um, we, uh, we might fill out the slip, take a picture, and then you'll be immortalized into the Pokemon card library. We got ourselves, whoo, starting off with an ultra rare breaking family. Already an ultra rare. Let's go ahead and sleeve it up. Whoop. Which means we can officially put up the VIP ropes with the all you can eat. Bagel bites, that's right. The all you can eat bagel bites, that's all we serve in the VIP section, nothing else. If you're thirsty, no water. We just we just uh, take a blender, blend up some bagel bites, and there you go. You got a nice bagel bite drink. <laughs> Going into Pumpkaboo, Carvana, ooh, na na, and a Sharpedo for the rare energy. Will we pull a card that John needs for his collection? We need to see those Glaceons, those Leafeons. Right now, 235. 235 is what? What? Oh, side up the best Pokemon in the entire world is what I'm going to have to uh, pay John. Unless, oh, unless I pull one of the cards that he needs for his collection. Going into the next Evolving Skies opening at Breaking Family next week. I believe next week right here on this channel. You should see the very first video from our trip to Japan. And... Worlds 2023. That's right, we will be in Japan for the Pokemon World Championships in Yokohama, and I'll be filming a lot of videos while I'm there, and as I'm filming them, I'm sending them over to John, he's editing them, and we're getting them up while I'm in Japan. So make sure you turn on notifications right now so you don't miss a single video all the way from Japan because we will be going to the Pokemon centers there. I'll be showing you around the Pokemon World Championships. You might see uh, a few familiar faces as well. I also believe the scavenger hunt, the Pokemon World Championship scavenger hunt is gonna make a return. Uh, we did that last year in London. There's gonna be a lot of videos from Japan. So get ready, Breaking Family, because it's happening. It's, hap it's happening. It's not, it's happening. It's happening. <laughs> Uh, right here on this channel, I am an official Pokemon partner. Pokemon, uh, the Pokemon Company International invited me or offered uh, me to be an official Pokemon partner this year. So, I want to give a big thank you to the Pokemon Company International for providing my creator badge this year and for taking care of my accommodations in Japan. It's going to be a good time. It's going to be a good time breaking family. I'm excited. This is my first time ever in Japan. And I'm going to try to document it as much, as much as possible. And there will be, of course, Pokemon card openings while we're in Japan. We got Rock and Rolla Energy. Put that in the filing cabinet. Ursa Ring going into Teddy Ursa with the Gorgeist. Now, for those trade slips, you actually saw some of them being printed out because I've been doing it already. So some people already knew about this. If I've made some trades in the past few weeks, I did this actually... Uh, while I was at the North America International Championships, so I got to uh, fill out some fill out some trade slips and uh, take some pictures as well. So the, the the immortalization into the Pokemon card library has already started taking place. We got Tropius and a Talonflame breaking family. We got this Evolving Skies right here. This is the last Evolving Skies, and then we're gonna go into Team Up. So unless there is an alternate art, Glaceon, VMAX, or V, or a Leafeon VMAX alternate art, then it's looking rough. Then it's looking rough, Breaking Family. We got Cutie Fly, Pikachu, Applin, Lillipup, going into Energy, put that in the filing cabinet right there. Why would you wish that I don't pull any? That's rude. That's incredibly rude. 
I, I wouldn't say rude things about you. You can ask anybody out there if they've ever met me in person. I've never said anything rude about you. No, never have. And you, thank you for backing me up on that. I appreciate it. I appreciate it very much, Psyduck. Thank you. We got Rescue Carrier, Scrafty, Pyroar, and an Ampros Breaking Family. Woo! Okay, okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Here it is. The Team Up 3-pack right here. John, Breaking Family. It's happening right now. We're opening it up to see if we can possibly pull Venusaur and Celebi. We're looking for the full art. <laughs> We're looking for the rainbow. We gotta find something. We gotta find something. There is the code card right there that will unlock that Deoxys. We got three packs. Of course, tag team Pokemon cards have skyrocketed, skyrocketed in popularity. Blah, blah, blah. I can't speak today. Here we go. First team up opening. Pokemon team up opening. We got Charmander, Mankey, Going into Litten, we got Amolga, Mary, Energy. Put that in the filing cabinet right back there. We got Omnite. Look at the eyes on that Omnite. It is. It, 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 it's scared. It just saw a ghost. Kangaskhan going into Alolan Marowak. And a Mighty in it. It's just the first pack. It's just the first pack. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not worried. You're worried. Not me. No. I'm not sweating at all. No, <laughs> I'm not sweating at all. Don't call me out right now. Don't call me out. There's the code card right there for that one. Don't forget, we are ending on... We are ending on the unbroken bonds that John sent over. Will will I pull a card that he needs from the pack that he sent me? <laughs> Amolga! Mary! You know, and, and, and all honesty, I know we're, uh, we're having a lot of laughs today, having fun. But this channel... This channel... Uh, a lot of, like I said earlier, a lot of the magic would not happen if it wasn't for John. Um, I love him very, very dearly, and uh, like I said, he is a friend first, and then he's uh, my my editor. We've had a lot of long, deep, meaningful conversations as well. Uh, he's the person I talk to every single day, and so uh, I just love the guy very much. And going into, whoo, Full Art Morgan. Oh, nice. Okay, breaking family. We got ourselves a full art trainer with the Morgan right here. Woo, okay. Now, John, you didn't have this on your list, but if you need it, text me. Let me know. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Very, very nice. Whoop. Oh, that was weak. That was weak. Let's do it again. <clears throat> Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. One more. One more team up booster pack opening to go. There's the code card for that one. Let's see it. Venusaur Celebi. We got Poochiana going into a Nidoran. Pancham. Voltorb. Klepki. There we go. Found my keys. I lost them. Energy. Charmeleon. Water Memory. War Turtle. And a Mandibuzz. Hey, at least we pulled something from the three pack. Now right here. Ending on the Unbroken Bonds booster pack that John sent me. He sent me this. But will there be a card that he needs inside of it? We are looking for the Sylveon Gardevoir Full Art or Alternate Art or Rainbow Rare. Any of those three. There's the code card right there. Let's see what we are ending on. Here we go. <laughs> we have a Ghastly, Tangula, Vinonat, Ratita, Goldine with those Kanto vibes, Energy, put that in the filing cabinet, Touracat, and everybody make sure in the comment section you say hello to John, tell him what, what kind of editing you like that you've seen here on the channel, just say hi to him, he's an amazing person, Surprise Box, Chat Tot, he makes the magic happen. He makes the magic happen. Reverse Halo, Koga's Trip, and Breaking Family. We are ending on. Can I get a drum roll, please? Thank you. And Breaking Family. We are ending on. Oh, Gollum! You ruined the party!
me, Breaking Family. That's it for today's Pokemon video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out the rest of the videos right over there. We'll see you all in the next video. And don't forget, I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.